Sa unang araw niya bilang punong maestrado, malaking karangalan daw para kay Chief Justice Lucas Bersami na isa siya sa tumanggap ng Gusi Peace Prize International kagabi. Ang Gusi Peace Prize ay iginagawad sa mga individual na may malaking ambag sa kanilang mga bansa, lalo na sa pagpapanatili ng kapayapaan, pagkakaisa at pagangat ng pamumuhay ng kanilang mga bansa. This prize, as I said last night, validates my service in the judiciary for 32 years. In that span of time, I came to believe that a judge could, after all, be a factor of peace. Ngayong taon, mula sa labing tatlong bansa ang binigyang pagpupugay, maliban kay Bersami, pinarangalan din para sa Pilipinas si General Antonio Tamayo na binigyang diin ang kahalagahan ng edukasyon sa ating bansa. Nelson Mandela says, and I quote, Education is the most powerful weapon, weapon which you can use to change the world. Ang punong maestrado naman, una raw na lamang ang tungkol sa Gusi Peace Prize kesa sa balita na nasa shortlist siya ng Judicial and Bar Council. I never expected to be to become the Chief Justice of the Philippines. Giving me this recognition through this Peace Award makes me happier because today I received two blessings from the Lord. Nanumpa kahapon si Bersamin sa harap ni Acting Chief Justice Antonio Carpio, isa rin sa limang pinagpilian ni Pangulong Duterte at ang pinaka-senior na maestrado sa Korte Suprema. Pagharap ng bagong Chief Justice sa media, ang issue ng seniority ang isa sa mga tinanong sa kanya. I will not uh, tackle that part of, uh, about uh, who between me and any other aspirant for this position to which I have been already appointed uh, fared as far as uh, comparing experience is concerned. I just stand on my own uh, personal record. I think that uh, I have served the longest in the judiciary. Uh, I leave that to the President to make a decision what he meant by uh, giving pre priority or preference to uh, seniority. Sa kanyang pagupo, pananatilihin daw niya ang judicial independence ng Supreme Court. Pero hindi raw ibig sabihin ay lagi niyang kukontrahin ang ibang sangay ng gobyerno. Your concept of judicial independence is that uh, government should all lose the case. Should lose the case. I, do, I hate to disappoint you. The government is often uh, uh, better the arguments than the other side. Pero nanghingan siya ng mensahe para sa kanya mga kritiko. Are there critics? <laughs> Do I have? I don't know. I have nothing for them but just to look uh, look for my achievements later. Para sa unang balita, Katrina Son reporting.